Hello love bugs. Welcome back to my channel. It's me Loverly. Today we're back again with another part of our Stardew Valley Let's Play. We are on part 63. Uh, we got a lot of good stuff from the mines and we just barely made it home right under the wire. We didn't pass out last night, which was incredible. Honestly, I was so scared we were, we were going to pass out, but we, we made it in just in time, just in the nick of time. So yeah, we got some good stuff from the mines. I gotta, uh, you know, go and organize that. Oh, you know what? Shoot. You know what I realized though? Uh, let me just double check. Yeah. Okay. So it's not Caroline's birthday until tomorrow. What is she like? <gasps> tropical curry. Ooh, that sounds a heck of good. Mmm, tropical curry. Oh, you know what that reminds me? Actually, so here's sort of uh, some fun news. I don't know if it's newsworthy, but um, I had my first fast food in like way well over a year uh, this morning. We went to Krispy Kreme. We finally, we finally braved the great outdoors and went through a drive through again. And it was because Krispy Kreme was doing this promotion where if you get vaccinated, you can get a free donut. So they totally, you know... <laughs> it totally worked on us and we were like you know what? let's go get our free Krispy Kreme donut today so because uh, we had some other choice to run anyway and so it was really good because they actually have these tropical donuts right now which are so yummy there's a, a key lime pie donut and a um there's another one that they were sold out of I forget what it was but then there's um my favorite was the pina colada donut because, oh my gosh, it tastes so good. It tastes like a pina colada. They did perfectly. Like, the key lime pie is a little disappointing because it definitely could have tasted way more limey. But the um, pina colada one, so good. Totally recommend. If y'all have um, gotten your vaccination, you can get a free plain crispy cream donut as well. So you can get a, a plain glazed for that so totally recommend going there and getting that if you'd like <laughs> but yeah like I said it was sort of like a big occasion for us like it's so random too it's like what it's like Monday the 24th like there's no special date about it just we were just like we had to go out to return some things uh f that we purchased online and had to send them back because they were the wrong size um but because we were out and about anyway we we're like you know what, let's just do it and yeah, so it was, it was kind of like a big moment for us because like I said, it's been like a full year, <laughs> like over a full year. The last time we ever ate out at a restaurant was February, 2020, right before everything, you know, happened. Um, I shouldn't want to really get it too far into but yeah, right before everything happened, uh, that was the last time we went out to get. And we didn't even get any takeout. Like, we didn't get any, like, the only thing we ever got was, like, groceries delivered. But we never got, like, fast food. So, it was sort of like a, it, it felt nice to feel like we are kind of returning to normal a little bit. <laughs> anyway, long story short, um, it was good. And I recommend it. So, um, but anyway, that tropical curry thing reminded me of that. <laughs> uh, so, that sounds really good. Tropical curry. Yum. Now I'm hungry <laughs> again. <laughs> that sounds really good. I love curry. All right, but then there's also fish taco. Yum as well. Green tea. Summer spangle. All right, I think we have a summer spangle we might be able to give to Caroline. Now the green tea actually, apparently, there's this whole side quest thing with Caroline that I didn't even know about. But apparently you can plant green tea leaves if you go and become friends with Caroline. So we might actually want to do that in this uh, playthrough because I never knew about that until we did it in, um, uh, you know, inches of snow tomorrow. Oh my gosh. All right. It's going to be a big snow storm tomorrow. Fascinating. But yeah, um, I never even heard of that until uh, Cloudy did it <laughs> in our save file. I was like, oh, I had no idea. I don't know if it's a new thing or not, but Spirits are in good humor today. They'll have a little extra luck. Fantastic. That's what we want to hear. All right. So let's go outside. Let's uh, organize our bins here. Uh, put the slimes away and the buggy meats. And we didn't, unfortunately, get too much in the way of, like, 
gems. We got really lucky, actually, uh, the first go. Oh, you know what? Should I, you know, I'm just going to sell these artifacts because I don't know what else to do with them. Uh, so I guess I'll put the cherry bombs in here. I don't know. Some of this stuff, I'm like, I still don't know where I want to actually put it, but. Um, yeah, we'll put, like, the natural seeds and things in here. Uh, stone and wood. Now, last time we didn't get our hardwood, because we, we got a lot of hardwood, but we need at least 100 hardwood, um, for the, for the horse. But otherwise, I think we're pretty set on hardwood, so I don't think I need to worry about that. Um, in here, we can put the crab in there, because it's sort of related to ocean stuff. Oh, yeah, I got this weird, like, dinky little uh, <laughs> sword. I don't even think it's, like, better. Is it better? I would think the steel sword is better. Level 1 sword. Level 1 dagger. I don't really know, like, why you would want the dagger. I don't think it's really probably necessary, but we'll see. I see that I have some mail. Let me, um, let me just sell the artifacts. I hope they sell for something. I don't know. I don't know if it's worth keeping artifacts or selling them, but I just sold them, so. Oh, well. Um, I somehow always have the same organizational system in every save game. Well, I mean, it makes sense. It's kind of just, like, whatever, you know, makes sense to your brain. I've got an unusual quest. Could you keep this a secret? I want you to deliver an amethyst to Emily. It's her favorite stone. Tell her it's from me, Clint. Oh, no. <laughs> I totally forgot about Yeah, Clint um, likes Emily. And it's kind of pain. It's kind of sad because, like, I have a crush on Clint, but Clint doesn't care about me at all. He's like, hey, uh, can you be my wingman? Oh, this dang chicken statue is just following me around. But, yeah, Clint's like, Clint doesn't even see that I have a crush on him. It's just kind of sad. <laughs> it's like, oh, rip. Rip my heart. All right. It's fine, though. We'll live. We'll, we'll survive. <laughs> I will survive. All right. There we go. And everyone, I know, I know what everyone's thinking. Y'all are just like, why do you have a crush on Clint? Clint's like a weirdo. I don't know. Heck if I know. <laughs> Gosh. Wouldn't it be nice to know why you have crushes on people? That'd be great. <laughs> I don't know. I like that he can make things. I think that's cool. I think that's neat. <laughs> I, because also my other options are like... I don't have the best options, all right? I've said this before in this game, but especially all the the guys in this game all suck. Hate Harvey. Harvey's a jerk. <laughs> Shane. Hate Shane. He's a jerk. I don't care if you love Shane. Shane's a jerk. You know Shane's a jerk, okay? Shane's a jerk. <laughs> we all know this. Um, You know, Alex is cool and Sam's cool or whatever, but like, I don't know. I never thought they were, like, all that. It's sort of weird as a old lady playing this game. Because, like, all these, like, <laughs> all these, uh, you know, eligible bachelors and bachelorettes are, like, way too young for me. It makes me feel weird. I'm like, Sam and Alex are, like, way too young. I don't know. I feel weird about trying to be with them. And Elliot's, like, honestly the only one I can really, like, I like Elliot because he's a beach bum. I'm a beach bum. <laughs> I love the beach. Um, and I love Elliot's long hair. And I love that Elliot's creative. Elliot's like a writer and a pianist. Like, I love that stuff. But I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I love, I do love Elliot. I think Elliot's the best male bachelor we have. And then all the, all the bachelorettes, though are awesome. I love Leah. I love Haley. I feel like there's the opposite problem where I can't choose between all the bachelorettes. Like Emily, Abigail, they're all awesome. Even Penny. Penny's cute. They're all super amazing. <laughs> so like, 
it's hard for me to choose, right? At this point, if we just went by based on hearts, that I have hearts right now, I'd go for Penny. Because I I just happen to have the most hearts. I don't know how that happened, honestly. Because I think I was trying to go for Abigail. Oh, no. Our, our hearts are the same. Penny and Abigail. I think I was trying to go for Abigail in the beginning. And, uh, but I don't know how I managed to get three hearts of Penny as well. I don't even know how that happened. I really have no clue. <laughs> but Emily's also awesome. Like, see, it's, it's really hard for me to choose. The Bachelor is, like, I get overwhelmed and I'm just like, I can't make a decision. But I know that, I just definitely know that there are certain ones, there are certain ones I just do not care for. And then there's other ones that I'm like, it's hard to choose, so... Does that make any sense? Am I making any sense? I feel like I'm I'm rambling. <laughs> I feel like I'm making no sense at all. <gasps> the winter roots. So the winter roots are those with the root salad is or whatever. Um. All right. What is it okay to sell like multiple chicken statues? Hopefully we get money from that. I'm gonna be kind of bummed if I didn't get money from that, but it's fine. Whatever. We'll see. Oh. Speaking of. I also have these to sell. Alright, I think that's everything I want to sell. And then we've got... Ore, iron ore. So yeah, the only reason why I was like, oh, maybe it would be funny. Oh, yes, we have five iron ore. Okay, we're going to make another one of those. Um, the only reason I was like, oh, it'd be kind of funny to go after Clint in this part is because it's a mod. The only reason why... Because I have been saying for years how, like, oh, I like Clint, and everyone gives Clint a bad time. And I like Clint because he's, like, an underdog. <laughs> everyone doesn't, doesn't see how awesome Clint can be. So, I was like, you know what? I would go after Clint because, you know, I believe in his potential coconut. <laughs> the same reason I was, like, saying earlier. I don't know. It's, it's a, I, I understand it's like an illogical reason. Okay. I, I understand this about this. I know it doesn't make a lot of logical sense, but you know what? Neither does liking Shane. All right. There. I said it. Shane is also, Shane is mean when you start talking to Shane. There's a lot of reasons why I don't understand why people are like head over heels in love with Shane. Okay. I'm just going to be honest. I'm just. Telling it like it is, okay? But, that being said, each their own, right? <laughs> anyway, I'm going to stop ranting about that. Um, wasn't there a classic movie that, like, a girl becomes this dude's wingman and then they get together? I'm sure. Oh, yeah. There's all kinds of funny little romantic comedies like that. I'm sure there's a movie that's like that. I don't know what it's called. Is it She's All That? There's one where they, like, did that, like, uh, makeover, quote-unquote, where she's, like, they act like she's ugly because she's wearing glasses, and then they, she, literally, all she does is take off her glasses and change her outfit, and then she's suddenly beautiful. <laughs> because they can't, like, imagine what she looks like without those things. And it's, like, so unrealistic, but, you know, that's how 90s rom-coms rom were, right? <laughs> Was it She's All That? Was that what it was i don't remember there, but there's so many rom-coms out there I, I i don't think i've heard of half of them yes the root platter is winter root and cave carrots nice yeah i don't know i don't really find a lot of cave carrots though i don't know why i'm doing this i just am. all right <laughs> but yeah we have um three out of five iron bars uh, one's currently uh, cooking right now, but we'll have three out of five. So we just need to go again back to the mines today. A lot of grinding in the mines in this part. So <laughs> hope y'all don't mind just having a chill Monday stream grinding in the mines. That sounds worse <laughs> than I... <laughs> that sounds bad. <laughs> that sounds like uh, not what I meant it to sound like, but oh well. Grinding in the mines. Uh, it was something like he was trying to get the attention of another girl and she was helping him. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. 
<laughs> should I do it or should I just ignore that whole plot line? Or is that the only way I can get my hearts up with Clint? That's kind of actually a little tragic, not gonna lie. It's a little, a little sad. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know about this whole, like, I always joked about, oh, you know, if I could date anyone, I'd date Clint. But the fact that, like, I still have to do that whole Emily, like, you know, quest line is, like, a little tragic. <laughs> oh, what's wrong with me? Alright, um... Okay, there we go. Oh. Yeah, I'm just like getting all of these acorns and stuff because it would be nice to be able to make more of those little, uh, what you call them? Y'all know what I'm trying to say, right? <laughs> this <gasps> kitty! Um. It'd be nice to make those, like, little field snacks again. I just don't have that many maple trees, apparently. I have way too many pine trees and not enough maple trees, according to uh, how many I have, how many seeds I find all the time. All right, um, it is already 1.30. What is wrong with me indeed? I have wasted the day chatting. Yeah, see, I only found one maple seed. Oh gosh, rip. Well, yeah, oh, do not sell this. Do not sell this iron bar. I almost did. Okay. Sell the mayonnaise. And then quickly run to the mines. Which is the fastest way to the mines? I think it is still this way, yeah? Sorry, puppies. <laughs> I feel so bad. They're like sitting in the snow with no water. I can't. I gotta ignore them. Um... You grind for both winter roots and cape carrots when you're in the mine. Oh, yeah? Um. I hope all the dirt patches in the cave carrots. And I hope that... Oh, you hoe all of them. Oh! Well, I do have my hoe with me. Why did I read that hope? Yeah, you hoe, uh, in those areas. Oh, my God. Can't run. Can't read chat and try to run forward. <laughs> Professional streamer. <laughs> um, no. the joke is I'm definitely not a professional. Alright, let's go over here. Okay, it's 3 p.m. But we're here. We're doing it. We're going down into the mines. Wait, should I eat something first? Probably eat something first, right? Let's green up before we get down there. Alright. I've been literally talking... Oh, gosh. Okay, well, here we are. Oops. <laughs> I didn't mean to. What is this? Hold on. <gasps> what is this? Oh, why does the copper ore look so different down here? Why does it look so weird down here? Ooh, it's spooky down here. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Ooh, okay. Do I need, like, a... I think I need one of those rings, don't I? I need, like, one of those light rings. What happened to my light ring? Do I even bother with this thing? Yeah, it does give me a bug meat. Alright. I was like, as long as I can get a bug meat from it. Uh, what was that? Oh, gosh. Dang it, scrolling. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay. I was like, ah, don't attack me. It's already 4 p.m. My chat stopped auto-scrolling, and I was, like, freaking out. I was like, no. Oh gosh! Oh gosh! What is that? Ah! Ah! Oh god! I'm, oh god! Oh god! Oh god! I can't see this thing that I'm hitting. Oh, uh, that is really creepy and scary. Are these bats? Apparently, these are both. Are these both bats, though? No, that doesn't look like a bat at all. That looks like something out of my freaking nightmares. What the heck is that thing? What the heck are these things? I hate them. Oh god, thanks I hate it, thanks I hate it, thanks I hate it, die 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 die. I can't see a dang thing. Um, this might, this might have been a very big mistake. I don't have one of those little light, uh, rings for some reason. Maybe I do, but I don't know where they went. Where's my light ring when I need it? I can't see. Where's my glow ring? I don't know. 
Oh gosh, what? You go back to the green levels until you can get a glow ring? Okay, where are those levels? Oh god, oh god! Okay, I think that might be what I was killing. Can I just get the heck out of here? Oh no, oh no, oh no. I don't like this at all. This is a bad idea. It's already 6 p.m. too. I'm so... Uh, I don't know if I can get the bug meat, y'all. Okay, what, what level should I... Should I just keep doing level uh, 25 to 30 then? Should I just go back to level 25? Or is there even more bugs uh, higher? Where did I come from? I'm seriously so confused right now. Oh, okay, I came up from up here. Alright, well, actually there's there's a stair down. Maybe I just go down. Yeah, there we go. We're good. Right? No, we're not. We're not good. We're not good. Why did I... We're not good. Okay. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. You know what? We're gonna just leave. We're just gonna... We're just gonna go. <laughs> it's fine. We're gonna go back down. We're gonna start from 25 then again. Right? Um, hold on. Before I do this... Two days left. Ah, oh, it's only 40. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> We got this. We got this. Yeah, as long as we get 20 a day, we're fine. We're gonna do it, because we've got, like, three more hours in the mines. Yeah, we got three more hours in the mines. We are good. We got this. We got this. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. We don't got this. <laughs> Why can't I? Oh, my gosh. Let me in! <laughs> it took 20 minutes just to figure out how to use a dang door. All right. Bug meats. Bug meats. Bug meat. Bug meat. Oh my gosh, this thing is like flung backwards. They fly so far, I can't even get them. Ugh, I don't need slimes. I don't need slimes. You're wasting my time, little slime. All right, that rhymed. Ugh, two hours. This is the worst. <laughs> I told y'all I suck at this. I I warned y'all. I warned y'all. I suck at the mines. Um. I like doing this part, you know, getting all the goodies. I like hitting the rocks. That's my favorite part about the mines. I don't like the combat. And so that's like when me and Cloudy play together, it's just, uh, I do the, I do the, um, rock hitting and they do the combat. <laughs> all right. Let's see. I just need a ladder. I just need a ladder. Who has got the ladder? I wonder where it is. There you go. Okay. Um. All right. We got three hours actually. We're good. I think I said we got three hours uh, last time, but I we got three hours now, so we're good. We got this. We got this. We don't got this. <laughs> We got it. We're good. We're good. Come here, little buggy. All right. Luckily, those are super easy to kill. And as long as those bug meats also count, I don't know if they do, though. Is it just the little slimies? Or is it just... It's any bug meat, right? All right. Oh, man. I we, we gotta find this uh, there now. There we go. Perfect. Heck yeah, lots of quartz. I mean, I'd rather be iron, but, you know. Fine, I'm not gonna be picky. Um, do I have to kill that slime in order to continue? I think I do, right? They'll count as as long as they drop the bug meat. Yeah. All right. Cool. Ooh, I got a geode. Nice. Uh, my ironing can should be done soon, right? Is it, is it two days or three days that the upgraded uh, items take? I think it's three days, right? I don't know how long it's been. <laughs> Did I do that yesterday in game? I don't even remember anymore. Oh my gosh. Okay. Apparently I have to aim. Lame. I have to aim. Oh, I have a half an hour. Alright, cool. Well. 
Um, hmm. Get any more bugs in like two minutes? Nope. That's a slime. I don't want to go by the slime. I just gotta go. Okay, I gotta go. We gotta go. We didn't make it, but it's okay. <sighs> Alright, uh, let's just go home. We at least got some good stuff, uh, but I honestly don't know. I don't know about the bugs. I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it, especially since it says I have one day and I still have to drop it off at Willie's too. I can't forget that step because, um, yeah, that means we're going to have to go there first thing in the morning. Like, I can't take care of my chickens first thing in the morning kind of thing. Um, so hopefully the chickens can survive. I don't know how that works. Um, but yeah. Alright. Luckily, the cats are still sticking to their bed. So luckily we don't have the issue that I was worried about before. Where it's like, oh, if we you know, come back home. <laughs> like, I was seriously worried that, like, one cat would take one bed and one cat would take another bed. But luckily, it seems like just buying a new bed has fixed that problem. So thankfully, there's at least that. <laughs> All right, and we made some good money with the farming and foraging and things. Okay, good. At least the artifacts did give us something. Not a lot, but something. You know, it's better than just throwing them out. So that's nice. All right. Uh, but yeah, that's gonna do it for this part. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. If you're watching it over on YouTube, please give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Comment down below what you liked. And as always, if you're not already subscribed, please consider subscribing. It would mean so, so much to me. And yeah, thank you again for watching and I hope you have a lovely day.